So I've wanted to do this interview for a long time. Some of you might already know him, but many of us owe our career path to this guy who invented Mavlink and PX4 and Pixhawk. Lorenz Meyer, CEO of Aterion. Nice to see you again. We haven't met each other in probably like five or six years. But I wanted to have him talk about the Skynode S and really the Dragon reference design. Uh, I was wrong about Skynode S when they first announced it. The product uh, is, is admittedly like tiny. You can open it in your hand. Um, extremely small, much less expensive than I thought. But really what I find so impressive is that it's part of a reference design that they're offering called Dragon, which is essentially like how you build a FPV, a tradable mass solution at scale. Uh, I think Autarion's done it for better than anybody else so far. It's kind of crazy. Uh, Lorenz, you want to tell us more about it real quick? Yeah, so when we when we designed ScanOS, we actually quickly learned with our partners in Ukraine that what they really need is a solution, not just the box that does compute, can host apps, including terminal guidance. But they actually needed to understand, like, how do I go from analog to digital? And that means moving to a digital camera, going, um, going to a digital radio. How do you put that together? Um, and so, in the end, we decided to build a reference drone. We're not building drones, but anybody who buys Skynode S can get help from us um, integrating it into something like this, which is a 10-inch racer, so that they now can go to market really, really quickly. Okay, okay so uh, someone exp showed this to me in Zurich. I'm not kidding you, because this is what blew me away. Is you, let me bring this back here. You literally grab the Skynode S, you connect the camera to it, okay, and you connect your ESC, and in the software, you basically set the angle of the camera, and that's it. So the one of the issues, many of you already know this, like building drones is fun, you can build them quickly, but configuring them is a pain in the ass. This is what I think Altera has solved. And the reference design, this is where I think some of the genius is, is that we can now actually, rather than worry about the integration piece, Altera solved that with us. This has SDK as well, I think Bobby was saying. So finally an SDK that we're actually able to build our own applications for. Um, and this is tiny. I think this is like under 800 bucks. I don't know how much it weighs, but it's extremely light. And it's the same footprint as standard FPV quads, like a 30 by 30 mounting stack. And it, it connects to a standard racing controller here. So you really have, it has power supply, the power supply on board. So there's nothing else you need. Is it built on Pixhawk as well? Or the Pixhawk FMU, or is it? Yeah, it's, on, okay. it's, it's derived from that. So you will, you will find it to be very uh, typical in the environment, and it has a computer, flight controller and computer are connected via Ethernet, so you can run ROS and really fast. Uh, so it's a very, very modern system architecture. And then if they want to buy it, what's the best way? Contact Ontarian Government Solutions, Todd, or whoever? Yeah. Okay, yeah, you, I don't have their contact info, but you want to go on their website. Obviously, vetted customers only. Um, doesn't come with terminal guidance, but you can you can get it, or you can point folks in the right direction to add it. So, so we, we're keeping this uh, purely commercial, which is better for us and better for our customers, so they can integrate it in commercial systems. But if you want terminal guidance, you can uh, work with us, install that. We're also working with third parties. We're creating an open ecosystem, so you have choice, and uh, we're also happy to help you integrate in, into a total solution. So. The, the level yeah. basically. Yeah, so this is like version one. I think version two is coming. You said it, it's already out there. Um, but this is wild. So that, that's a doodle radio, it looks like, plus this uh, autopilot and then a generic camera. And there you go. Um, and it's shipping right now if they want to order it. Yeah. Sweet. Lorenz, man, thank you so much. I really appreciate you. Sincerely. Cheers, Thank you, man. Really appreciate it. Thank you. Cheers.